Welcome back. Today, I'm going to show you how you can start a faceless YouTube channel without spending money on tools, voiceovers, and screen recording. Have you ever watched these types of videos and wondered how they are actually created? Take a look at this channel making over $5,000 monthly and this one making over $3,000 a month. They have generated over 5 million views in the last 6 months just by uploading these types of videos. What's the idea behind all these channels? They are creating quiz videos. These videos are typically well edited with captivating animations to grab viewers' attention. They make videos like Guess the Country Challenge, Guess the Music Challenge, Guess the Movie Challenge, and so on. Did you know that you can actually start your own channel today? I'm going to show you a step-by-step -step tutorial of how you can create your own video without spending money on any tools or services. Firstly, let's talk about the best tools to create these videos. The top tool is Canva, which is an online graphic design and video editing tool. However, many new content creators find it difficult to pay for Canva Pro, which provides access to all the features. That's why I've searched for an alternative to create this type of video. My number one alternative is CapCut, one of the best free video editing tools available. I'm going to demonstrate how I made this video using only CapCut in just a few minutes. In this video, I'll be creating a Guess the Logo Quiz Challenge. Step 1, download the necessary files for the video, including a GIF countdown sticker, logos of different companies, and a background image. To download a GIF countdown sticker, visit jiffy.com and search for countdown stickers. Choose one based on the time interval of your questions and answers. For the background image, I'll download it from Canva and remove any additional elements attached to it. Alternatively, you can find a suitable background image on freepick.com. To download company logos, I'll use the website freepinglogos.com. Other websites like Pingtree and Pixabay are also great for finding images and elements. Step 2. Let's begin the editing process. Open CapCut, the video editing software, and click on Import to bring in the required files for the video. Drag the imported background to the timeline and extend its duration slightly. On the top left corner, click on Text and then select Default Text to add text. Move your cursor to the text area on the right to modify the default text with your desired text. In this case, it will be Guess the Logo Challenge. Below the text area, you'll find options for color. Change the text color to blue and position it at the top. Click on the font above the color and font size to select a suitable font. Adjust the length of the text to match the background image. Drag the countdown timer sticker to the timeline and reduce its scale. You can position the timer at the bottom left or bottom right corner, but I've chosen the left side. Next, import one of the logos and place it on the timeline to appear a few seconds before the timer. Add another text element and change the default text to answer. Adjust the color and position it to show up after the logo image, using the same font. Now, add another text element. This third text will display the name of the company whose logo was shown. For example, MasterCard. Edit the text and consider adding a background color by scrolling down and selecting the background box. Arrange the text and position it to appear after. The next step is to add audio effects. Click on the audio option on the top left corner and then select the mechanical sounds category. Scroll down and choose the clock sound effect. To add a second sound effect, navigate to the performance category, scroll down, and select the right answer sound effect. Adjust the duration of the clock sound effect to match the countdown sticker timer. Similarly, adjust the duration of the right answer sound effect and align it with the answer text.
feel free to arrange the clips and text to your liking. Next, let's add animation to the texts and logo. Click on the element you want to animate, then click on animation in the top right corner. Select your preferred animation style. Now, our video is ready. But how do we start over again for the next logo? Don't worry. We can make this one our template and add many more logos within a few minutes. How do we do that? At the top left corner of your timeline, click then drag it down to highlight every element on the timeline. Right-click and choose Copy. Place your mouse at the end of the timeline and click to set the timeline line. Right-click on the other side of the timeline and select Paste. Repeat this step as many times as you like. For this video, I'll have three templates. Now, go back to the second template. Right-click on the logo image and select Replace Clip from the drop-down menu. Choose your preferred image to replace the logo. For example, I'll choose this logo. Click Replace Clip again. Do the same for the third template, replacing the logo and changing the corresponding text. And there you have it. Our video is now ready. Remember to like, share, and subscribe to this channel for more educational videos like this. I'll be posting amazing videos on how to make money with AI and other free tools.